Hello and welcome to episode 17 of my Age of Empires 2 HD edition tutorial let's play series. Um, this episode will be on starting the campaign the cleansing of the Louvre. So as you can see we've done the unlikely messiah, we've done the maid of Orleans, now we're moving on to the third chapter which is the cleansing of the Louvre. June 14, Orléans. Our rescue of Orléans was a setback for our enemies, but only a minor one. The British still possess half of France. Tragically, we have cooled our heels for weeks while the Dauphin's advisors debate. Jean became irritated with the delay and reassembled her army. She talks of nothing but her mission to drive the British into the sea. The force of Jean's will is titanic. She has gathered to her banner, swearing brigands and knaves, and turns them into patriots and heroes. Among them is the man La Hire. A giant clad in plate mail, he drives men on with curses and fists. There will be plenty of British necks for La Hire to break at Pate. Pate is the gateway to the Loire River Valley. The British hold the Loire in a grip of steel, whilst a huge army under Sir John Fastolf devastates the countryside. John leads us to Pate to capture the British castles. However, we must avoid Fastolf's army till we are strong enough to face his veterans. Okay, so destroy at least three British castles and Joan must survive. Uh, if we look at the hints, make sure you have ample siege weapons before assaulting the English castles. The area across the river to the east should have plenty of resources to begin your town. So that's what we're going to have to do. Begin a town and uh, gather resources. So let's start by scouting out the map and seeing how the land lays. Where our enemies will be with coming. these ships, we can cross the Loire River and deal with any British warships we encounter. Okay, so let's get these boats over here. ships just got sunk um, thankfully it weren't the transport ships so let's move all my troops over here uh, La Hire wishes to kill something <laughs> uh, let's move my troops to here while well, I've still got a couple of transports I don't know what happened to my other two ships I think they must have got destroyed instantly vaporized um, but that don't matter as long as I can get at least one peasant across and Joan It would have been nice to be able to use the one of the warships for scouting. See where it's safe to cross. The blood on the ears all is almost dry. Okay, so that's my boat's full. Here looks like a good spot, I hope. Yeah, let's disembark. Um, oh no, I need to do that again. And put them down there. Okay, let's send this boat back for more troops. And this boat. Send them over there. Oh no, look at this. Not good. Not good at all. That was a warship. So, yeah. They're after my transports, which I do not want to lose. Or maybe it's a scout. But anyway, let's get my troops across this river. That's the first thing. Let's send this boat over here. And this one. Mm, this is 
swing left. Okay, that's nearly them all over. I'll use the scout to scout out the area. Well, I need to move Leave these it. away. Let's put these just over here. Right, okay, so this boat now I can just send off to get destroyed and map out a bit of the map. Let's get these last three troops over. This one I'll send in this direction. just be easier just to click up there and see how far it can go. Let's check out the other boat. So he's mapped all of this side of the shore. Oh, and there's an enemy building there. Okay, this boat can map out this bit. How's this one getting on? Wow, this is a big river network. Okay, let's go back to my troops. Oh, they've been getting attacked. I've, oh, I've still got a peasant left, thank goodness. Now let's use the scout is the best one to quickly map out the map. And there he is. So I've first got to find where the English are camped with their big army and get to the other side of the map of them and then fortify. See and find, try and find a good place for a base where there's stone gold and uh, a lot of trees I guess I haven't found any gold or stone yet wow Right, because there's an enemy shipyard over here, I'm suspecting that this is where the English have settled. Uh, let's take a look. I'm 
maybe not. Ah, there's some stone. the edge of the map. Plenty of trees as well. Now if there's some gold around here this might be a good place for me to start my base. Looks like there's an enemy. So this is the first thing you really have to do is work out who, where the enemy are and where the resources are. So there's gold, so I found stone and gold. So it's definitely looking like over this side's a good place, unless, oh no, that's the enemy. Let's see, how big's their base? tower there. Yep, here's their town alright. Okay, so what that tells me is maybe I need to go over this side of the river. Cross over here. So let's move all oh, yeah. my troops over here. There's enemy over here as well. I'm not really bothered about the sheep, to be honest. So here's some more gold. Lots and lots of sheep. Right, I don't want to get too near that tower. And there's stone, right, so that's where I'm going to go. Let's move these sheep. Let's get my troops. Start building a town. I'm building up defences before they start attacking me. and keep mapping out this area Wow, that's 15 minutes already. Okay, another enemy tower. I'm hoping these are just loose towers that I can destroy. Let's see where they lead to. Oh, there's an 
enemy castle. Okay, let's move all of these. Where is going to be the easiest place to defend? Move them all up here, I think. Right, so I'm going to need food. Um, before the very first thing, of course, is a town centre. Um, where is it? There we go. So that's the very first thing to put down. And I'll put it just there. Oh no. Put it there. Fast so. Fast so. Hey. Fast so. While they're building that, I'll keep checking if there's any more deposits of stone or gold that I can put towers near to defend against the peasants, uh, the enemy's peasants from gathering. That's really one of the first things you want to try and do as well. Guard all of the resources. There's some more gold. Where's there some stone? There should be some stone around as well somewhere. Right, that's my town centre built. So let's switch back to my town. And the first thing is do some upgrades. Right, they're all chopping wood, but I need one to be gathering stone. One, two to be gathering food because I'm going to need food. And lots of it. And then I can do another peasant. Or a few, five more peasants. Oh, I need houses first. Right, he can build a house. And I'm going to build my houses all along the edge here. Check out my scouts doing. Okay, so I've started my settlement. I've mapped out a bit of the map so far. I'm going to uh, continue though in the next episode. I'll leave this episode here because the timer has gone. I don't want it to run on too long. And in the next episode, I'll continue to build up a base. Try not to get my scout killed and see if I can find another deposit of stone. I've found some gold, which if I'm quick enough and build a tower near it, it will protect it from the enemy peasants of gathering it. But I shall continue that in the next episode. Wherever you are in the world, God bless you and keep every last one of you safe. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.